Yo, so we're on day four of building this DEI website. We put buttons on the page, we put a picture on the page, we put links to our policies, we've done all of that. Today, I'm gonna show you how to put a survey on the page. I know as a DEI professional, you take a lot of surveys. You send surveys out, you wanna get the feedback from the, from the community about what's going on and do something about it, right? So how do you normally do that? What do you create a spreadsheet or a Word document and send that out? Or you go to like SurveyMonkey and try to cook up a survey over there? You don't gotta do all that if you got Microsoft 365. Today I'm gonna show you how to put a survey on the site. And I want you to remember something too. There's multiple ways to do this, but I'm gonna show you one of my favorite ways of doing it. And then you could just either take that way or you know what I mean, learn about some other ways. Don't worry about that because if you come to the um, workshop that I'm doing on the 28th of October at 11 a.m., then you can get your questions answered about this type of stuff. So don't forget, click the link and sign up for that survey. I'm the survey. Click the link and sign up to come to the workshop, October 28th, 11 a.m. Eastern. Come holler at me. Now let's jump into the site. All right, we are back at the DEI site. You see the picture, you see the link to policies, the mission. We put the buttons on there yesterday. So today what we're going to do, I'm going to create that survey like we was talking about. We're going to use Microsoft Forms to do it. You go to the app launcher, click on Microsoft Forms, click New Form, and then you create your form right here. So... I'm going to go super basic right here. I'm going to just say this is the employee um, climate survey. You can call it something else, something way more exciting, something that people are actually going to want to, you know, take. But uh, I'm just going real boring, real old school here. We're just going to make three, um, three questions. So this first one is on a scale of one to five, how included do you feel? And we use a rating question to do it. So see how you can pick from these five stars. How do you feel in, the, in our workplace where one is not at all and five is completely? Um, like how, how included you feel? So now this next one, this is an answer that people will actually type their answers in. So we grab that question, um, we make it a text, but then we change it to long answer because we want to make it look like, you know, there's more than just one sentence that you can give here. I want you to give like an actual in-depth answer. Um, so, you know, how do you, how, have you observed any instances of bias and discrimination in the last six months? Uh, if so, please describe. Um, then we're going to do another long answer. This one is, uh, do you believe the organization is committed to fostering um, an inclusive environment? Now, please provide the details. So, long answer. There's our three-question survey. You can make your question however, I mean, your survey however long you want. That's cool. Whatever. Anyway, collect responses then get the link. This is the link that you send out for people to take the survey. But if we just look at a preview, you can see this is what they'll see when they take the survey. So uh, copy that link. Let's go back to the DEI page. So now on the DEI page, we are going to add a link to that actual survey. So we edit the page, and I'm going to add a new section. I'll show you why later. I'm adding a new section. So hit this new section. I'm going to change it to one third like the one below it. And then <clears throat> I'm going to add a text field. And so it's kind of like I'm putting an ad on the page because it's going to be at the top of the page. It's the first thing you see when you get here. Um, and I'm going to be talking about this survey, I don't know, over the next two weeks. So I just want to make it super easy for people when they come to the site to take it. So, hey, the, what I just did is I wrote out, hey, take our employee climate survey. Again, very boring, but you know this is uh, just for example purposes. So now we're going to add a button web part. We're going to put some text on there which says take the survey. Then I'm going to paste that link that I got from Microsoft Forms in there, and then I'm going to put the button in the middle of the, um, that, that, uh, that, that web part. Uh, so now, because I've added that new section, look, I get to play around with the colors. So I can change it to the big orange or the light orange or the gray or go back to white. Uh, all of these are pretty ugly, <laughs> but I'm going to stick with this uh, light orange. And <clears throat> even though it, you know, it doesn't look the best, it's still better than what you're doing right now, which is probably sending out PDFs or sending out spreadsheets or sending out uh, uh, Word documents. Instead of this, instead of you doing it through email, you're just going to send people to the site and let them do this. So I'm going to say we actually care. Then I'm going to press the Windows button and the period button, and I'm going to get those icons. I'm going to get the smiley face. I'm going to put it on there. And now everybody's going to be excited to come take this survey. This is the way you want to collect responses to a survey. You do not want to be sending out files and attachments and having people download stuff 
and people doing all types of things. You want to control it, you send it out. And look, we click on the button, that's what they'll see. Too easy.